636 this morning. It's a Chiefs fan's worst nightmare. Yeah, saving, saving up. up your money to buy a ticket and then you get scammed and can't go to the big game. I am a diehard fan and that is gut-wrenching to me that if I don't get to be there this Sunday. But the harder part of this is that it's a realization there are people out there like this. And it's a hard pill for someone to swallow. Like, it's a real ding on humanity. Man, Janelle taking it better than I think a lot of us would. You no. can read her full story on our website right now, KSHB.com. A pretty well thought out scam to get her money. That's more than one way to be duped, though, when you're looking for a ticket, whether it's the AFC Championship game or the game after that. And yep. that is why this morning, 41 Action News reporter Ray Daniel showing you what to look out for before you cash in on a big ticket. Ray. That's right, Lindsay. You know, there is no line here at the Arrowhead ticket office, but this is one of the best places to go ahead and get your tickets. This is one of the safest places as well. So here's what you need to know. If you take a look at your screen, we've talked a little bit about just ways to avoid getting scammed. One of the first things you want to do is to go to a verified website that offers a ticket guarantee to make sure your order is backed. Places like Chiefs.com, Tickets for Less, and StubHub. You also want to be aware of last minute service fees. Some secondary market sellers will add on last minute service fees at checkout, tacking on a lot of money at the very end. And avoid Facebook Marketplace and Craigslist. Those are a uh, little risky and often lead to scams. Now, the biggest red flag is someone trying to sell you a paper ticket. You don't want to be fooled. One of those things is paper tickets. No paper tickets are valid because they are all mobile entry. Um, another thing would be screenshots um, that somebody might send you on your phone. There are rolling barcodes on mobile entry, so those screenshots will not be valid either. So we did check out Chiefs.com. The cheapest one we saw was right around $270. So if you see one that's much less than that, it's probably a scam. Reporting live at Arrowhead, Ray Daniel, 41 Action News Today.